Yes guys, I am back with some brand new sniping filters. Let's make you some coins. For cheap and reliable Foot23 coins, head over to u7buy.com. They deliver fast and reliable Foot23 coins and make sure to use code MUZZ for 5% off at checkout. Links in the description. Yes guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today's video we have got some very effective low tier filters especially because a lot of you guys have been messaging me saying how effective some of the low tier ones are. Even if you're on like a couple hundred K like me, 300 K, I think the low tier ones are probably some of the best ones right now. Um, so I've got quite a few of them in this video. I've also got one mid tier one as well, which is really, really good. Um, and I've been mentioning recently the mid tier budget ones, like they're really hard to find at the minute because of how weird a lot of the price ranges are. He only to update a lot of them. There's players that have like a 50k price range that are worth like a thousand coins. It's just pointless. Um, so hopefully once I fix that, we'll have a lot more mid-tier filters. But uh, we're going to start off with a low-tier one. We're going to go to the MLS. We're going to go to, not gold, right? we've got to go to gold, Brazilian. Um, and we've got a couple um, golds here that are selling for bank. I think it is literally just these two. We've got Luis Araujo and we've also got Joao Paulo as well. They're both, I think, bang on around this 3,000 coins mark. Yeah, maybe slightly under or so. So it's only about 150 coins tax. So we'll snipe for about 2.6. 500 coins! Oh my god, that's the good thing with these. some of these non-rares. People list them for the dumbest prices. 2.2. Oh. 2.7 for Joel Paolo, so not a bad little snipe. That gets listed very quick though, boys. So we're going to flip that for 3,000 coins for a lazy buyer, and that should sell. Okay, next up, we are going to head over to the Eredivisie next. We are going to go to a left wing filter, actually. We're going to go to Eredivisie left wing and gold rest so we've got i believe it's two players that can pop up we have got 84 tadic and we've got the 83 uh, gakpo um gakpo is slightly cheaper i think let's find the cheapest by now i think they are about 1.6 1.7 so yeah, gakpo is about 1.6 1.7 and tadic is around that 2k mark maybe slightly over uh, but not by much in the slightest so if you hit tadic you're going to get a little bit extra profit uh, but i mean gakpo alone just gets listed left right and center so um, him alone, you can make a couple hundred coins a card on very, very easily. I will say early doors, if you want to use any of these lower budget ones as sniping filters, all you got to do is, in the max price, any bids we win for, what, 1.4 or under, uh, just go spam a load of bids. And, uh, yeah, the bidding method should work pretty well as well. 1.4 for Gakpo, there we go. Nice and easy. We'll get that flip for 1.7. Piece of cake. Okay, boys, this is not a drill. We have got a mid-tier filter. Like I said, I've struggled to find them a lot because of the random price ranges players have. Uh, but we've got Manchester City filter. Love to see it. So we're going to go to Premier League, Manchester City, Spanish. We do have to put gold rare on, otherwise that silver will pop up. Or you can just put gold, whatever, you, whatever you're feeling. Uh, but these have gone up quite a bit as well because of some SBCs and stuff like that. Uh, so we've got Laporte. And we've also got Rodri. They are near enough the exact same price. I think Rodri is about 16. Maybe Laporte's like 15, but near enough the same. Um, the tax here is about 800 coins, roughly. Round on about that 800, 900 coins uh, tax. So, as always, find the cheapest. Take off 800 coins or so. It's about a bit less than 800 coins down here, actually. 13.5. Our first snipe, boys. And uh, that is, it's that easy. So we're going to get that listed at 414, 750. Easy as that. You don't even have to be that quick. Right, next up, this is one of my personal favourite filters. Um, as of right now, a lot of these do work well, but some of them work better um, just randomly. So sometimes they just do work better, uh, depending on what time of the day you snipe as well. So we're going to go to Syria, Juventus. We're going to go to Forward and Gold Rare. So I'll quickly show you the two players that can pop up, I believe it is. Uh, we've got 284s. This should be a filter that works pretty much all year round. We've got Vlahovic and we've also got Di Maria. Uh, these are still very, very cheap because 84s are on the floor right now. I think they are on this 2 to 3k mark. Yeah, Di Maria, yeah, both 2.4. Easy as that. Uh, so only like 200 coins tax or so, maybe slightly more than 200 coins. So I'll snipe for about 2.1. And it gets listed straight away with a shadow on. What the f I'm going to break my monitor. I used to whirr. Vlahovic. Oh, yeah. F this is getting listed so quick. Maybe a bit of competition on this. That's the only slight issue. 1,000. No. <laughs> okay, for this next one, you guys know I love a silver filter right now. And this is insane 
this is really low budget as well so even if you've got like 3000 coins we can do this filter very very easily um the only thing is you guys watching it if a lot of you guys are doing it it might not work as well but uh premier league silver rare just no position or anything like that i will give you a position one in a second but premier league silver rare is hands down one of the best silver filters right now because these are very pricey uh, for silver rares anyway they're like 900 coins minimum and just think of the amount of uh, silver rares in the uh, in the prem there's so many only 50 coins tax down here like so literally you can snipe for 800 coins flip for like 900 plus you're gonna hit some silvers that are worth thousands as well um, that's what i was finding earlier um, and this also works as a gold mine for bidding as well so any bid to win for 800 or under um yeah, absolute gold mine. So I know there's 40 minutes left, but again, just go spam up all of them up until the hour marker. So come back in an hour, go make some food or something. Uh, and if we win a load, happy days. Uh, the other one is you can go goalkeeper as well, because I think they're slightly more. I think they're about 1,000 to 1,100. Uh, so you can play about with that. Just go silver rare or go silver rare goalkeeper and enjoy cooking all the coins. And you love to see it. We did manage to sell off that Laporte very, very quickly. So... Um, nice and easy profit right there. So next up, we are going to go over to the Eredivisie once again, or the Eredivisie, however you want to say it. Uh, we're going to go to PSV this time, and we're going to go to Brazilian. I think you need to type in gold as well, because I think they've got a scrappy silver in there. Uh, but we've got two players that can pop up here. We've got this Afro Giza, and we've also got Mauro Jr. So I think Jr. is actually worth quite a bit more. He's 4 to 5k, which is mad. So check if you've got him in your club. Get him sold. Happy days. And this guy's about two and a half to three. Um, but incredible to snipe once again. As a low-tier filter, um, yeah, people will list these non-rares for really, really cheap. 1.9. Our first, the first one that pops up, we do end up winning nice and easy, boys. There might be a little bit less competition on this as well. Uh, so we'll get that listed for, I've completely forgot. I think he's at 2.4, 2.5. Solid. And before we do jump on into the final filter of today's video, we do a little quiz at the end of every video, just as soon as we made it to the end. Um, yes, I did show you this CDM. I did blank out his nation, his rating, his shooting, defending and physical. Um, and some of you guys did get it as well, so fair play. The answer was, if I pull up the answer, it was Tanali. Uh, so fair play if you got it and made it to the end of yesterday's video. So today's video, we're not actually going to do a quiz. I want you guys to give me some advice on my team. Because uh, I'm looking for some advice. Uh, so, let me know of any upgrades I can do to the team. I've got 300k, so I've got a lot of coins to work with. I preferably don't want to use all my coins. I want to stay a little bit liquid. So, maybe put like 100, 150k towards my team. So, if you've got any like 100k upgrades for my team, let me know in the comments. And I appreciate you if you made it to the end. I still haven't tried Ronaldo if, after packing him. Um, and I still haven't bought Bruno either. I need to do it. But uh, if you wanted to do Kessie, by the way, he's decent. And Chimeni's not too bad either. Probably a little bit more usable this year because uh, of the new lengthy shite, whatever that is. Pedri, not too bad. So um, let's jump in to the final filter as well. We have got another Brazilian filter, actually. Brazil's just working tidy um, for the low-tier ones. I think it is mainly because of hybrid leagues. Um, that's the main reason their prices are up. So we're going to go to... The Saudi League, we've got to dig for it. So Saudi, Brazil, and we're going to have to gold rare. So this is more of like a really low one. Sometimes we've got like a 2 or 3k. Uh, I think these are like 1,000 to 1,200. But the good thing about this, we've got Talishka, we've got Iger, and we've got Roma Romarinho. And they're all like 1.2. Um, and again, the tax is that low. You can literally snipe for 1,000, flip them for 1,200 very, very easily. Some of them, the uh, Romarinho and stuff, he'll get listed for like 700 coins because he's got a price range down to like 650, I think. Same with Talisca, actually. I think he's down at like 700. So you'll be able to get some snipes for really, really cheap and get like four, three, four, five hundred coins profit a card. Like that. But obviously don't mess up the snipe. Uh, so yeah, good example of that. And you can build 5k quite easily with that filter so hopefully you guys have made some good coins we are making a few other sales they should sell after the hour mark that's usually what happens um sometimes when it gets to the hour mark they will uh lazy buyers will buy them they always do um and yeah hopefully you guys have enjoyed i think we're getting is it sterling today no we're getting a gakpo play of the month soon uh, it's currently 3 p.m so we're going to get a gakpo play of the month hopefully that rises some prices maybe don't think it will uh, and we're also gonna get a sterling one to watch sbc soon as well so um i'm not gonna lie yeah you need to pull your finger out a little bit i want this market to rise a little bit 
it's, the market's weird right now. Some players are mad expensive, like Haaland's extinct. But I'd say good 90 to 95% of gold, I just discard price. Discard price. And there's not loads of new filters, aside from like Brazil, some silver filters, there's not loads. Um, I think once I start these price ranges, though, the mid tier market will be flooded. Because like last year, I gave so many mid tier filters every week. They were my favourite filters to give out, pretty much. Uh, and I've barely been able to give you any because of the price ranges. So, yeah, sort your shit out. Update the price ranges. Bring out some good SBCs to increase prices. And, uh, yeah, we'll cook some coins. So, yeah, I will be back tomorrow. If you guys could drop a like, that'd be appreciated. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Goodbye.